Daniel. Daniel! Daniel, talk to me! Daniel! Talk to me! Oh. 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 No. No way, not now. Daniel! <sighs> Oh shit, Madison. I told you it was a fucking kid. Get off of me! Get off of me! Well, Daniel! Is he? He's my brother! He's okay. Bullet just grazed Let him. Let me go! Do not move if you want to keep that arm. Comprende? Keep an eye on the wall. These fuckers blew it up so their friends can cross. Daniel! So what's the plan, huh? I bet there's a dozen more coming through, right? No! We're leaving! Going to Mexico, I swear! Wait, wait. You're trying to break into Mexico. <laughs> That's fucking funny. We're Americans. Americans, damn it! Now it's not legal to blow up walls. That's called terrorism. You get it? Listen, it's a long story. We really are trying to get out of here. You can fucking skateboard across the border ten miles away. So tell me the plan. That was not us. We have no idea how it happened. It, don't fuck with us, kid. You're the only ones around. Looks like no one's coming for now. Anyway, don't waste your energy. I bet the Border Patrol has a big plan for you, mister. Madison, come on. We have to deal with this kid. No, Stop bleeding. Don't touch him. Get off. Yeah, don't move. What? What the fuck? Get it off. Stop. Get it off. Jesus. What the fuck is going on? What? Where's Spencer? He's off duty today. Why? <laughs> Listen, uh, we have a deal, he knows. Yeah, I heard about this crap. Not happening anymore. Come on, Maddie. Do what the officer says. <sighs> fuck! How old is he? He's all right, officer. Don't worry. Shut it! You're both coming with me to the station. What? Are you kidding? What? They're illegals! Fuck's sake! What I say? Uh, okay. Uh, uh. Take a breath. You okay now? Daniel! What? Uh, I'm sorry, are you Sean? Sean Diaz? <laughs> You're under arrest. Don't look at me. This is bien. Si. Yo soy Diego. Mi... Mi esposa Carla. Y este frijolito de aquí es... Um, 
Es Ángel. Oh, Ángela. Encantado. Eh, soy Sean. ¿Cómo te sientes, hijo? Um, ¿Han visto un niño de 10 años? Es mi hermanito. Nos separaron uh, cerca del muro. Está herido. Lo llevaron a la enfermería. Si fuera grave, una ambulancia ya habría venido a buscarlo. Si lo dejaron aquí, quiere decir que está bien. Tranquilo, amigo. Aquí no hacen daño a los niños. Seriously. Why are you doing this? What's your problem? Doing what? You shot my 10-year-old brother. It was a mistake. It's just a graze. The fall is what knocked him out. Oh, you don't have to talk to him, Dad. What the hell is wrong with these people? No way I can break through that door without Daniel's help. Excuse me. Do you know where my brother is? He's just a kid. This guy must be trained not to listen to anything we say. Saben cuánto tiempo nos van a dejar aquí. No. Esta es la primera vez que intentan cruzar. Me acuerdo de nuestra primera vez. Casi morimos de sed en el desierto. En realidad, um, queremos llegar a México. ¿A México? No mames. Pero, ¿por qué? Entonces son gringos. Sí, nacimos aquí, pero ahora tenemos que irnos. Todos estamos escapando de algo. Es la tercera vez que intentamos cruzar la frontera. Son muy valientes. Y además estás embarazada. <ríe> Mi Carlita es la mujer más valiente del mundo. <ríe> Y la más inteligente también. En nuestro pueblo era profesora. Queremos que el niño nazca en este país. Que tenga la nacionalidad. Queremos darle una vida... Una vida mejor a nuestro hijo. O hija. Pero... No es elegir... La solución más fácil, escaparse de sus problemas, en vez de quedarse y afrontarlos. ¿No es lo que están haciendo ustedes? Tú, más que nadie, tienes que saber que no hay nada fácil en cruzar desiertos y fronteras para sobrevivir. No quiero desanimarte, amigo, pero lo de México... No va a ser fácil para ustedes. Es un país magnífico. Y me cuesta muchísimo dejarlo, pero... allá va a ser muy complicado cumplir tus sueños. Ya no tengo sueños aquí. Sean, has vivido en este país toda tu vida con un padre mexicano. Y ahora los tiempos han cambiado. ¿Cómo crees que va a ser todo en el futuro? Los tiempos cambian, pero la gente también. En el camino, encontré muchos aliados. Ojalá haya menos personas intolerantes en el futuro. Ojalá. Cuando eres extranjero, tienes que trabajar aún más duro para arreglártelas. Así funciona. Oh, shit. Enough now. It's America. We speak English. We're just talking. No, the problem is you people breaking into my country. We come here to work, not, not steal or live at your, at your home. Diego. No, I am so fucking tired. You only come here to cause trouble. 
and we have to pay for your welfare. You all want a free ride, and that makes me sick. Come on, stop causing trouble. Nana, excuse me, but I didn't blow up a fucking wall. I'm not a terrorist. We only want work and, and, and in peace. Yes, an honest job and the ability to raise our child in a safe country. That's all we're looking for. <laughs> That's what you people always say. But the facts speak for themselves. My dad was an immigrant, and he worked his ass off, raised a family, and made a business. Yeah, and his son ended up in jail. What a role model. Thanks for proving my point. Damn right, baby girl. You hunt us like, 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 like animals. I don't think I have a choice. I want the safest country for my children. See? You love your family like us. We don't go walking hundreds of miles in the desert and risking everything for no reason. We do it for our child. A mother must understand. Now you and your unborn parasite have nothing in common with me and my family. <laughs> what? Maddie. what you say? <laughs> oh, see? There you go. Take it easy. This is our country. Siéntate, Diego. Solo vas a empeorar las cosas para ustedes. Tienes razón, amor. No vale la pena. Whether you people like it or not, we're not gonna give you a break. You're in jail too, loser. Why are we stuck down here with them? You know us. We're helping you, goddammit! Hey, you have the right to remain silent, so fucking use it, okay? <sighs> All right. Diaz, you're up. How's my brother? Don't worry about him. Now turn around. Hands behind your back. Okay. Let's move it. Sit down. Where's my brother? He's doing fine for a kid who got grazed by a bullet. Lost some blood. But he's tough. They're taking care of him at the infirmary. You want coffee? Okay. Good. Be right back. <sighs> Fuck. What did they do with Daniel? Great. Now I can put on a fucking show. No, I got oh, shit. Is it morning already? No point in getting these off. There are cops everywhere. How am I gonna get myself out of this mess? How am I gonna get myself out of this mess? Shut up. What? You don't get to talk to me like that, Mama Cesar. You understand? No point in getting these off. There are cops everywhere. Great. Now I can put on a fucking show. How am I gonna get myself out of this mess? What are you babbling about now? Do you ever just not yell? It's been a long fucking night. We're all sick of your shit. If I have to come back here again, you're going to solitary. Got it? Oh, shit. Is it morning already? Haven't seen how am I gonna get myself out of this mess? There you go. Looks like you need it. Thanks. All right. 
Let's see. Hmm. Okay. Damn. Seriously? No. Shit. So tired of all this shit. Yeah. Coffee's gonna make me feel so much better. At least it'll keep me up. Jeez. That's quite a crime spree. It's hard to believe what kids can do nowadays. Killing that officer in Seattle. Vandalizing a motel room. Caught in a, another weird explosion at a pot farm in California. Then you join a religious commune in Nevada. Hmm. Oh. Which ends up burnt to the ground. And... <laughs> We're not even halfway down the list. One of those things you could get away with. But not all that. It sounds crazy, but I can explain. Explain it to Agent Flores. She's on her way now. She spoke to your mother, who took responsibility for the church fire. That's not true. She had nothing to do with it, and you know it. Don't drag her into this, okay? She's a good person. Hey. It's not up to me, kid. Listen. I feel sorry for you. I really do. But... Denying what you did will only make things worse. I did what I had to do. I needed to protect my brother. I know, son. But running away from trouble is never a good solution. You know, I read the report. You claim that Officer Matthew's death was an accident. So why didn't you wait for the police? I panicked, okay? Then it was too late. We were already criminals. Well, it's no reason to make things worse by running away, kid. Good news is, your brother's too young to be prosecuted. He'll end up with your grandparents, if they want him. But you're facing a shitload of years between bars. At least he'll get a life. Uh... What I don't get is how two kids can destroy so much stuff. I mean, anywhere you went, something blew up. Seriously. How? Those were just random accidents. Yeah, it's crazy, but... It just happens around us. I can't explain it. Uh-huh. Listen. Once is an accident. Twice is luck. Three times is enemy action. Whoa! Uh, what is that? Sir? I don't think you should... Keep your ass in that seat. You okay? How do you feel? I, I'm okay. Just a little headache. Hold on. Dude, we gotta go. Hold up. Is he okay? I I wanted to rescue you, but I I had to use my power. I didn't want to hurt him. He's okay. Don't worry. Shall we try to make peace with these morons? Well, 
Carla and Diego. They came all the way from Mexico. And got thrown in jail for it. He's up for the count. How the fuck did you criminals get out, huh? Maddie, don't. Okay, hands oh, up! Shit! Don't right up. shoot! Hands up! Do not move! Wait! Sean? Stay back, Daniel. Let me think. Sean, what do I do? Quick! I gotta find something to stop them. The chair! They're dangerous! Fuck. Be careful! I'm scared. Crush them! Now! No! I don't want to kill them! You're right. Next plan. We will shoot if we need to! Don't do Understand? anything stupid, kid! This is our last warning! Put your guns down! Please! Shot! Anymore. You saved us. You had no choice. Now, oh, let's bail. Sean, I think our things are in there. Hey, hey, hey! Step what did you do? Back. You fucking murderer! Nice. Don't move. I'll be right back. Okay, but be quick. After this, you're not gonna hunt shit anymore. Bet it belongs to one of these trigger happy people. Pretty good memory. From a pretty bad place. There's probably more of them coming. Let's go. Come on, Sean. We gotta go! We would be so dead if we didn't have Daniel's power. Take it out, Daniel. Time to go. Chasing us. Not yet. Emergency. This is all points volunteer for every unit in the area. Two prisoners. Both teenagers have escaped using violent force from the El Rey police station. They are considered armed and dangerous. Repeat. Are we still going to Mexico? Yeah. We got nowhere else to go. Sean. It's the 4th of July. Our first one without dad. You're right. Remember how he was so in the fireworks every year? He always made us go too early so we could get a good spot. <laughs> I know. He was so corny. He said he was proud to live in this country.
Sean, what are we gonna do? You know that day in Seattle, the date Dad was shot? I think about it every day. And I would give anything to change what happened. But I can't. I'm sorry for my mistakes. I tried my best. I swear, Sean. I'm so proud of you, Nano. Just like Dad would be. We both learned a lot together. But you can make your own rules now. If we surrender, they will separate us, Daniel. And if that happens, promise me that you will always do the right thing, okay? Don't. Waste your power. Be smart like you already are. I don't want to be separated. Whatever happens, always remember that you're Daniel Diaz. I promise you. So, how does the story of the Wolf Brothers end? Hi. I think their story ends right here. Here? I could. I get it. It's not who we are. Exactly. We're not criminals. We're just kids. And we still have time to choose what life we want to live. You're my brother. And I love you. I... I love you too, Sean. It's gonna be all right. I promise. You promise? For real this time? I do. We're doing the right thing. Just... Try and remember what I taught you. I mean... Only the good shit. I will. I swear. <laughs> on your knees! I said on your knees now! I'm sorry about all this. We're gonna look after your brother. That's my word. Okay, he's ready. Sean! No! Sean! Oye, oye, oye. Oye. He's gonna be fine. Daniel! You're not a little wolf anymore. 
Never forget who you are. Never. <laughs> Thank you.